call me at a bad time. I swear I'm not always like this. It's just been a rough month for me. What can I say? Daddy's gone, and Mama married my uncle. These notes I play on my therapy, but even my art cannot fill the deep, raging gap in my heart. Here's my uncle, the new Don, Claudio. A man with no class, no respect, no shred of decency. Nothing like my father was. So smug, so arrogant. He once killed a man by removing all his senses. You know what that means? First the fingers, then eyes and ears and nose and mouth. Just like you learned in elementary. And those rings. Each of his whores got a ring print before they're gone. Never been sober in his life. Five DUIs perpetual mountain of coke in his vault, and he's marrying my mother. And yes, my mother, my sweet, sweet mother, Gertrude. A beautiful woman, a terrible soul. Daddy dies on Christmas and she marries Claudio on New Year's. The mother who raised me is no more. Selfishness reigns supreme in this family. Look at him. It's this rehearsal dinner, and he's so sauced, Oedipus would say he's fucked up. I am not drunk bit. enough for this yet, I'll tell you that much. Have you been drinking? Oh, God, you please. Maybe a swig or two, Have you but been that's... drinking? I'm... Literally, we're getting My married sweet one cannoli. time. My what? sweet, sweet cannoli. Do not cannoli. speak cannoli me, okay? okay. You're right. One God. time. Don, you're Literally right. just one Don, listen. You're right. I'm sorry. Mm. I'm doing all right, though. I got dressed by myself today. <laughs> oh, come on, kid. Get up. Get yourself together. <laughs> there we go. That's it. Serenity now. All right, so I'm not the strongest guy in the world. Saying, uh, 
Claudio, um, how's the insurance game treating you? It's good, my son. It's really good. And you know what? No more of this Uncle Claudio shit, okay? You're my son. Little, come on. It's been a month. We're all getting over it, okay? You know, I'm serious about you calling me Pops. You're my son. You hear me? You hear me, you little shit! Yeah, yeah, all right, all right, okay, okay, jeez, jeez, yeah. So now Claudio, drunk, obviously, decides to say a few words. Polono, you've been by my side since day one. I really appreciate that. Ophelia, you beautiful damsel, you. He doesn't deserve you. And last but not least, my lovely soon-to-be wife, Gertrude. You truly do amaze me. There's nothing more to say. Now as for business, this feast marks the beginning of a new era. We will dominate every nook and cranny in South Philly. Now, tomorrow is a big day. Our family is going to be united once and for all. Not just Gertrude Hamlet and I, but the whole family. But right now, I'm just focusing on us, Gertrude. My sweet little cannoli of a wife. Get over here. Let's get married. Not gonna lie. I was a little hammered myself. All right, now I'd like to say a few things if it doesn't uh, offend anybody, you know. Uh, oh man, how lucky we all are to be here, you know. You know who would have loved this feast? My father. My father. Be done. Sorry, I apologize. Am I not allowed to say his name? Now, to those of you who stand by Claudio, I simply say, Afalava! I am the Don's son. I was the one that brought you coffee while you were meeting with my father. I was the one that cleaned the blood off your shoes after you're off somebody, all right? And what do I get for that? Huh? Misery! I did my time, and I'm here to take the reins. I need the reins. Instead of this motherfucker who sits before you. Ugh. You miserable little fuck. I ought to cut you like a fish. You can't talk to him like that. Shut up! Mommy! <laughs> it gets a little blurry from here. I... I... <laughs> Dinner's over. Everybody get the fuck out. The smartest girl I know. What the fuck was that toast, Mileto? You're not giving me that fucking lip, Harriet. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's just they're trying to squeeze me out, you know? They're trying to squeeze me out. I had the throne. It was mine. It was mine. I was supposed to be king, and now Claudio comes in and he's saying, what are you, what am I supposed to do? What, am, look at my life. It's shit. It's shit. Absolute shit. You're a fucking mess. I mean, what are you going to do? You know, I just don't know what to do, Harriet. You know, everything in my life right now is so, you know, up in the air, it's here and it's there. You know, I do know one thing for sure. I want that bastard Claudio gone. I want him gone from my family. I want him gone from this earth. I got your back, Leto. Come yeah, on. Thanks. Thanks, Harry. And she was right. She always had my back. And it was going to take a lot more than a toast for me to take down Claudio. I needed something big. Real big.